Guys, there is an amazing sale going on at Bath & Body Works. It's going to last until supplies last. Um, candles, well, the ones I got were 50% off. I could be making that up, but I think I'm telling the truth, but I don't know. Um, are the candles 50% off? The select ones? The seasonal yeah. Ones. The seasonal select ones are 50% off, and then I did pick up some wallflowers. I believe that were like three dollars so like if that's your zhush your vibe definitely get here they're just having like an amazing sale and i'm so excited because i stocked up because i want because i wanted to get stuff for my home i'm a smell good girl all the way around i didn't pick up any like body stuff but this one right here a thousand wishes is that what it's called yeah i could be making a thousand wishes warm sugar vanilla um my guy is obsessed when i wear this i don't know why you guys he just loves it he's like oh my god you smell so good i want to just devour you and i'm like it's japanese cherry blossom he loves it so i always keep that in my stash shoot hold on i'm dropping stuff everywhere you guys it's not good but anyways yeah are we ready oh my gosh that was so quick so yeah get here get here fast the sale is going on it's going down for real okay bye good morning besties let me show you really quickly before i head down to the gym i gotta go out and it's so cold and it's raining you guys and it doesn't matter you got to get to the gym anyways um lilabo they gave us some cute samples of like shampoo conditioner um lotion stuff like that right and then i did pick up which i shared with you guys this here it's so cute i love the bag this is the lotion i was gonna get the oil but i'll be honest with you the oil wasn't very fragrant so i picked up the um Centile 33, this is the lotion, and I absolutely love it. So this is really good. Uh, they do have a shampoo and a conditioner, I believe she said, or at least at that particular location. The lotion retailed for $76. I already have the fragrance, if you didn't know. Yeah, I do. Um, I love their bags. I'm probably gonna... Can I get this out of here? okay so then and so then i did pick up a candle i have been wanting this candle this is sandhow 26 this is what i got on the candle hot sexy lovers this fragrance is just so uber sexy to me does she tape it oh god is it tape i can't open it well i have to rip it okay i will show you the candle girl don't break your nail so uh oh you have your candle it opens like this and this is it here oh gosh it smells so good now i will let you know how it burns it should burn evenly she said you can burn it for up to three or four hours at a time so i'm excited about that i love candles oh it's so good i cannot wait to burn this so yeah i am gonna burn this and the candle retailed for $82 not bad I've paid more than that for candles before so I mean it wasn't too bad um it's not huge but I hear that it has a good burning time so I'll let you know if this this is my first time getting a candle so I'll let you know if it's worth it in my opinion or not and then I did share with you guys that we popped by uh Bath and Body Works. They are having an amazing sale. Girl, guy, they are having an amazing sale. I just got a few things because I kind of keep my home stacked with uh, candles already, but I picked this one up. This is called Chocolate Espresso Martini. It smells like chocolate, um, but it smells more like an espresso. It smells like coffee. I love when my home smells like coffee. That's why I love brewing fresh uh, coffee. This one is called Twisted Peppermint. I love it because it's really strong. This is like something like if you were cooking something and you wanted the house to smell, a thing I need you to focus, and you wanted the house to smell really good and take the scent away, this would definitely be one to go with. It's very strong, it's very good, and you only have to burn it for like two hours. I get this every single year. Okay, I move on. I got about four of those. I got like the same candles. I told you I don't like candles that smell like food or cake. Uh, I picked up some of these stocked up on some of these why not 
they're on sale they look cute this is gonna match my decor in my office because it's white and gold thing focus what else is new it's like white and gold and when you uh, plug it in it stays lit 24 7 I love that uh, what else did I get um, I stocked up on a few of those and then I just got a ton of these like uh, bulbs here because these are all over my home all over the office all over the closet it's everywhere um, I'm trying a new one called Central Amber it was really good and musk suede this right here smells like a hot sexy man this one right here reminds me so much of my guy mahogany teak wood oh my god it's so good if you have not tried this one you should it is so sexy it smells like a hot sexy man freshly showered and shaved and lather I'm just saying I'm just saying anyways <laughs> another one is this one here um, this is sensual uh, sensual amber uh, I picked up a ton of those for my office sometime we both like these in our office uh, stress re girl this is the this is the ghetto okay this is the ghetto if you need one for stress this one's really good this one is good for stress relief it's like stress relief and eucalyptus and spearmint uh, it's very strong but very relaxing and I love this I even put this in my shower sometime too so I got a ton of those bulbs more candles and that's it yeah that's all I picked up okay you guys I have to go I'm going down to the gym I'm gonna keep the vlog going and another thing I just received in like literally in the mailbox um, is my Fenty lotion I didn't want to miss it so let's see and this is supposed to be the one that smells like vanilla I believe this is the one that smells like vanilla you guys know um, I'm not a big fan of fragrances or anything that smells like food so the cinnamon one I went in I played with I didn't love it so I didn't pick that up but vanilla 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 is right up my alley this is a consistency of it I am hoping that it is the same consistency as the original oh I wish I had a spatula I don't like using my hands girl just do it okay let's see I'll do it right here let's see what it's giving it's supposed to have sparkles in it it's supposed to have shimmer oh okay it feels nice it feels supple hydrating all the good things oh my gosh okay can we see the sparkle you guys see it do you see the sparkle a tap bit a little bit look real hard look hard look harder it's there they're very very subtle but they are there I guess you could put on more I didn't put on a whole lot you seen what I got out but it feels good it feels like the original Fenty it feels very hydrating now what are we saying about the scent oh okay oh my gosh it kind of smells like a warm vanilla cookie darn it's still giving me that but it's good it's not it kind of smells Grimond a little bit. I know you're not really able to see the specks of sparkle there, but that's what it's giving. So it's nothing that's going to be too in your face or nothing like that. It's very subtle, but it feels really good. And the smell is there. It's not overpowering. It's slightly there. So you can see the sparkle right there. And it's really nice. This would go with any of our fragrances, especially the ones that have vanilla in them, like uh, Kayali Vanilla 28, my WW84, just a few that come to mind that are gonna pair so well with this. Even my Sol de Janeiro, because it's kind of gourmand even, and this is too. Oh yeah, I'm loving this. This is good, okay. Oh, this feels really good. So let's see, hold on a second. Yeah, this right here, as soon as I smell this, this is a fragrance that came to mind. I'm already about to give you your first combo, okay? I'm already giving you your first combo. As soon as I smelled the lotion, I automatically thought of Kayali Vanilla 28. It's along that realm of vanilla, in my opinion, and this is gonna be my combo of tonight, and I will let you know how it paired. All right, I gotta get to the gym. Okay. I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems I solve them. I run through the money, the press will be calling. Left on my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage. I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression is all that I wanted. The phone and affection, I summon and dub it. Cause I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems I solve them. I run through the money, the press will be calling. Left on my all right, and for lunch, you guys, I totally went shopping. I didn't bring the camera out at all, but I promise you, it's on Instagram. It's on Instagram. 
Um, but I don't know if it's gonna come out at the same time. Anyways, um, I've heard so much about Sweet Green. It's totally fitting in my healthy living life right now. So I am trying it out. This is a spicy, I don't think it's spicy. I think it's like a chicken spicy rice bowl. I don't know you guys. It's made with arugula, carrots. It's got some Parmesan, some grilled chicken. I picked up one of these drinks. I've heard nothing about good things about them. They have no sugar. I think it was like really low in calories. Um, I thought it would be something different other than water. Is that five calories? Yeah, it's only five calories, girl. Guy, five calories. We can make that happen. I put some ice in it. And I'm having it. It does come with this bread, um, but I took it off and put it to the side because who needs the bread dwelling? I may have a piece. I might eat a bite. Stop judging me. Pick somebody else. But anyways, you guys, it looks really good. So I'm super excited. It came with this goddess dressing. I got it on the side because I like to distribute my dressing evenly because I want to taste it in each bite. I did pick up ta -da, Tom Ford. Tom Ford. Check the scoreboard. It's Tom Ford. Okay, I'm gonna enjoy my lunch. I did pick up some stuff from Aloe too. Most of the stuff I wanted, they didn't really have. It was like, um, order it online, and I'm not an order online kind of gal. I'm like a right now kind of girl. So yeah, um, all right, I'll hit you back. Hey besties, I just finished doing my review for um, Tom Ford Lost Cherry. Gosh, girl, it is not Lost Cherry for Tom Ford Cherry Smoke and for Tom Ford Electric Heart. And it's not called Electric Heart for Tom Ford Electric Cherry. I don't know why I can't say this name right. Because I did a video for another brand called Tom Ford, no, no, Electric Heart. And this is Electric Cherry, and it's just not registering to me. But anyways, Electric Cherry, I share all my in-depth opinions and thoughts on both fragrances. Um, you know I bought them both, so I must, you know, really like them both. But yeah, I was super excited. I just finished up at the gym. I think I shared that with you guys. So yeah, I am going out to dinner tonight, and I will see you guys later. I think I'm going to end the vlog here and start a new one, because tomorrow night, we have dinner with friends and i might get dressed i don't know my skin's doing horrible don't ask me about it oh my god i was in chanel the other day and she was like oh my god your skin is so stressed i was like you're telling me you know what i mean because i was trying to get some like a makeup i keep seeing on tiktok and they couldn't match me they didn't have any shades that matched me uh perfectly it was like i would have had to get two and blend them out and get this powder and all this other stuff and you know i'm not here for all that if it ain't quick and easy i don't want it so I was like, never mind. And she was like, um, I think she was, I don't know, she was like their specialist or something. And she was like, oh my God, your skin is so stressed. And I'm like, yeah, I know. My eczema is going really, really crazy right now. Um, it wasn't, it wasn't on my legs. It wasn't really anywhere. It had even cleared up all off my face. But within the last two weeks, it's been raining here like crazy. The weather's been going bananas, doing its own thing. My face has flared up. My eczema on my legs have flared up. I'm like, oh my gosh, so thank God for my Karma Sutra and my, you know, I bought all these, you know, Eucerin, Aveno, Alvedo, or whatever, Nivea, all this different stuff for eczema. And my dermatologist gave me some stuff too. It goes away really well. It's not that. It's just that I'm like, oh my God, this again. There are worse things, you know. It's not about that. It's just that I hate, you know, I just, I just don't like it. I, I don't like it. That's all. I don't like it. You guys, I'm rambling. I'm thinking if I want to have myself a second cup of coffee. I really don't need it, but I really want it. You know, everything you don't necessarily need, but you want. And I'm thinking I'm going to get myself that cup of coffee. Stop judging me. Pick somebody else. We don't judge each other over here. It's only my third cup. You know what I mean? I've cut down tremendously. Typically, I'm only having two cups a day now. Um, that's not bad. Some days I used to have four. One day I had five. That wasn't a good day. It's <laughs> like, oh my God. <laughs> Girl, what is going on? But anyways, yeah, that's it, you guys. I'm gonna stop holding you. I have nothing else to say. I'm done. So I'm signing out here with the vlog. I hope you have enjoyed this. I don't know what I'm gonna call it. A weekly vlog? A daily vlog? I don't know what it was called. It was more like the weekend and just a little glimpse into the week. I worked out. Uh, I shared with you guys what I picked. I don't even know what's in it. I, I'm not. I'm going. Okay, guys. Until next time, you know the drill. If you haven't hit the subscribe button, and this is your vibe because it's what it is. Go ahead and consider hitting this. Ugh and I can never speak, go ahead and consider hitting the subscribe button. Don't stop there. If you really want to become a bestie, make sure you come over and say hi on Instagram. Slide in the DM and say, hey, growl, how you doing? Um, what else was I going to say? I think that's it. Um, I'm on TikTok, you guys, but 
it's not serious i just have a lot of fun over there but um yeah that's it i hope everybody is has uh, again girl you gotta get it together you gotta learn how to talk again i hope everybody is having an amazing day and i hope this video finds you with um good cheerful love and laughter or i hope it leaves you with some cheerful love and laughter okay all right that's these i'll talk to you in the next one be blessed stay fit and definitely stay fabulous doing things thanks for watching bye